Godsmack has unfortunately had to cancel their upcoming European tour after a terrible tragedy has impacted guitarist Tony Rombola and his family. Uh, in a new statement released from frontman Sully Erna, he speaks about this terrible, terrible situation that nobody should have to go through. Uh, this is after word broke that Tony's son, Joe Fay passed away at just the age of 34 years old. And at this time, there has not been a cause of death which has been released. Uh, the statement from Sully Erna says, with my deepest regrets and on behalf of our guitarist, Tony and his wife, Sue, I personally am writing this message to all of our fans worldwide to inform you that Joey and his family have suffered a loss that no parent should ever have to endure. Tony and Sue's son, Joe Fay, passed away last week unexpectedly at the age of 34. He was one of the kindest and most humble guys I had ever met. And most importantly, he was a fan, just like all of you. He literally lived the success of Godsmack through his dad. He was always so excited and proud just to be around us. And we all miss him dearly. As we await more information on how this happened, we humbly ask that you respect Tony and his family's privacy as they take time to process this and heal. We appreciate all of your patience, prayers, and support in this very trying time. And I promise you, we are coming back bigger and stronger in the beginning of 2019. And we will honor all of these tour dates in Europe and across the globe. So be ready. There is a lot of speculation and buzz out there on the internet about what that could be that took his son's life at such a young age. But we will not speculate about that here unless there is some sort of official cause of death that is released. This is a very tragic situation and our sincere thoughts and prayers go out to Tony and his entire family and the rest of the guys in the band. This is just a very, very sad situation to see and our hearts go out to everybody involved in this very sad situation. That is all that we know for now. As always, you can stick with Rockfeed for updates on breaking hard rock and heavy metal news around the clock. If you wish, you can subscribe with notifications on. And again, thank you so much for tuning into Rockfeed as always. Uh, this is a very sad situation. And uh, as Godsmack noted, they will be back stronger than ever in early 2019 as they move forward past this very, very sad, sad tragedy.